Hello, I'm Richard Hooper and this is SAT TV. Now I'm here at the APSCC Conference 2009 in Kuala Lumpur and I'm pleased to be joined by Dr. Maslan Othman who is the Director, United Nations Office for Outer Space Affairs. Now, earlier today I listened to your keynote speech and you mentioned the use of satellites for healthcare. Can you explain a little bit more? Well, as you know, the United Nations look at global health as one of the most important issues facing humanity today. And uh, as the Office for Outer Space Affairs, what we have to do is to see how space science and technology can assist in um, making the world a healthier place for all. Now, there are, um, there are several ways space science and technology can contribute. The first is obvious in the sense that satellite communications can be used to link a doctor with, some, with a patient in a remote area. This is the telemedicine aspect of space technology. There is also another way which is we can use our remote sensing satellites to take images and from those images uh, analyze them for the spread of disease. Um, we think that it, this will be, will be a good way of, um, for instance, seeing how malaria spreads. Now, as temperatures rise, mosquitoes can reside in cooler and cooler, what is usually cooler and cooler uh, area, and thus spread um, the, the extent of malaria. So, and this is what we call teleepidemiology. And so those are the sort of things that space science and technology can assist in making the world a better and a healthier place. Now, your office is obviously pushing the satellite companies to you know, achieve this. Mm. Has it been achieved yet or over the next couple of years are we going to see some new developments? Well, we are pushing uh, the member states and we're hoping that the member states will push their private sector. And I think there is greater and greater awareness amongst the member states of the utility of space science and technology uh, for health. And I'm sure we'll see uh, progress in the next few years, good progress in the next few years. Dr. Othman, thank you very much. Thank you.